she's awake. I'm so tired. I feel like I didn't sleep. Probably went to sleep at like 3 a.m. Hey, stretchy. Doing downward dog and upward dog. I did yoga with Adrian and meditated. <laughs> lot of curvy roads. I don't really know if I'm going to leave this site. I'll probably just stay nearby um, and walk around. Rico's going to be working on a fence. Oh, these birds just like flew. They were blessing me with their presence. I'm glad that he is getting um, experience on building a fence because we've been talking about doing that to our yard our front yard and then he said after he learns how to build a fence he's gonna build me a house <laughs> so cute he's gonna build me a yard Hi guys, so we finally made it to our destination and um, Rico already went up the hill. I'll show you guys where I'm going to be hanging out. Last night I didn't get much sleep. We had our meeting with Eliana. She is our artist manager, Matrix Slayer. We met up with her and we just have like so many creative ideas, um, so many things that we've been working on. and. I really appreciate everything that you know she's doing for us and manifesting Mount Shasta is where we would like to live uh, we've also been manifesting Hawaii uh, Rico has never been to Hawaii I have been once to the big island and um, I'm ready to go explore again and so you know it's just amazing we started talking about Hawaii and then Rico reached out to one of his friends and he is actually in Maui and ideally we would like to visit Maui as well so there's just a lot of things that are going on right now I'll show you guys where I am as you can see the address is 222 and 222 um, it resonates with me a lot even though my birthday is 221 there's a lot of meaning behind 222 it's an angel number last night I forgot how the subject came up but Rico I asked him something about his grandma like how old his grandma is and then I started talking about my grandpa there's just a lot with that and so it makes me know that he is here with me at all times he's watching over me and um i'm gonna show you guys where i'm at so let's see and obviously we went to seven leaves because you guys know how addicted we are to seven leaves two locations in san jose we went to the location in saratoga the worker she didn't see us when we walked in her name is Anne Marie. She's like, Giselle! <laughs> we are definitely one of the regular customers that go to Seven Leaves like every day. <laughs> it's where we data crush, and data crushing is. We call it data crush because 
I don't know if you guys have ever watched Star Trek Next Generation. Data is one of the commanders that helps with the Enterprise. He spends his free time just like learning all these things and he's an android so he doesn't sleep. <laughs> and so when we're data crushing, we're just like, but anyway, let me just show you. Let me... Um, as we were driving in, I was like, did Miles buy this house? And he hasn't told us yet and we're all gonna like live here. Definitely somewhere I would love to be because it is away from, you know, the city. Um, so it's more like out here in, in the heart of nature. So the guys are up the hill over there somewhere. I haven't even went up there. I did get a little bit nauseous coming over here because there's a lot of turns and um, I didn't get much sleep last night. I went to sleep like at 3 in the morning and woke up at 7.30. I'm really tired so I'm gonna be taking a nap and I did, I'll show you guys, I set up my yoga mat in the back. I have a hatch. Thank you for checking up on me. I hope you guys are having lots of fun. Woo! Enjoying the nature. <gasps> I finally put on my shoes. I saw these beautiful flowers. Freaking beautiful here. Wow, you guys hear that? I feel like a lot of people, especially if you live in the city, nature is definitely something that you need to connect with. I'm just so blessed to know people that have these kind of homes. It shows me that this is definitely somewhere that I would like to live. Look at all this land. It's incredible. Connecting with Mama Earth. What does the fox say? <laughs> Do you guys remember that song? Like the guys are done with the fence. It was really nice hanging out here. Here comes 